Oh, oh, what's up, party people? Uh, yo, yo! <laughs> we got yourself here, a uh, hygiene, hygiene, hygienist. Hyena, TGA, hygienist. Or jackaxe. <laughs> and we are going to show you the tutorial on how to play Diablo 6. 3, 4, 2, 1, let's go! Alright. We got a little host here, Joel, but he's listening to the music. Touch tribute. Joel's nice. here. You can hear him in the background. Yeah. Pop pa poop pa the N word. <laughs> there it is. The N word. Niagara <laughs> Falls. Don't say the N word. That's the Niagara all at its you know, best. You me into this. <laughs> God damn it, you're not right. Joel, you're the one who wants to be a podcaster. That's your dream. <laughs> What's up, party people? What's up, party people? I'm Joel. I'm your host of the podcaster. <laughs> I create podcasts for all the fellow people. Anyway, sorry, I was distracted because you had some question marks there, friend. <laughs> question marks. I asked Joel if he wants a headset. He was <laughs> <laughs> no, he's psychically uh... connected. Uh, yeah. Anyway, there, Gregster, or sorry, G C A Ster. <laughs> Can you stop your moaning for a second and look at your weapons? <laughs> Here, have a chip. That'll oh, help I you know mine. I do. I, oh, I know I do. I have that uh, green one, right? That one you're talking The question about? mark, man. Identify the unidentified. That's oh. what James Cameron always taught us. What? <laughs> 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 Alright. <laughs> Ukrainian so, like, car bomb. Ukrainian car bomb. Hey, I like that. Mm. Why does my beer taste like apples all of a sudden? Because of whiskey. Not ready yet. Sorry, Joel, I can't hear you because you don't have a headset. <laughs> Why are all these cultists just hanging around doing their cult shit? Like, how cliche can Diablo get? We gotta stop the cultists from doing their cult shit. Diablo 1, stop the cultists. Me. Diablo 2, stop the cultists. Greg, Greg, do you use that rolly thing with me? I've tried a couple times. That thing seems very scary. It's a lint roller. Well, it just... It strengthens your core, basically. That's all it is. It'll work? I don't know. I've used it like three times. I was not the office chair. Oh, wow, this one's really got the nail on head on that one. Get a couple drinks in me and I go down to about a 20 IQ. Get a couple of drinks in me and you go up to a 10. Hey, oh. Sorry, Greg, sir. I mean, Ty Genius. I do need to say. I know. I was it hard to remember. Because you like to play golf or you like to play GTA. I don't fucking know. Just it's a a he was calling you smart. I'm yes, not a genius. I'm not. That's what he's calling me. Hygienist. Hygienist to Tundra, Tundra Golf Tundra Association. Tundra. There you go. I'm not Hyena going anywhere until Uncle Deckard's been laid to rest. Uncle Deckard. Can do no less for him, but afterward. He must be avenged. <laughs> I actually just said that. Like Speak my character just said that cliche line. This is ridiculous. We will see the king as we depart. <laughs> but afterwards, he must so, be hey, avenged. Can you take thing with you? I guess I can. Talk about the shit in your fridge. So oh. our buddy Jeff, Jeff Gregerson. I just got a bowl or half a cow, and my freezer and my other little deep freezer is full. But we won't tell the FBI about that. Why? Half a cow? You can't have half a cow in your freezer. Well, my brother has half a cow. So, yeah, why? Well, it's, it was it's a murder butchered. joke. Oh, <laughs> Jesus. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I get it. It's sure butchered, enough, though. That one <laughs> it was gotten from a reliable source. Across the seas. That's where all the reliable sources are. Across the seas? Across the seas. Why? Got it from Costco. Yeah, and across the seas. <laughs> My friend, shall we depart to Caldea? It ends in 24 seconds. Oh, I don't want it to end. Dude, I know you hate first person shooters, but we gotta shoot some shit up. We do. I don't know if I have any on here that I can't download. 
I know how much you had to throw. I it's saw upsetting. how many there were. It's upsetting. It was probably about 300 slices. Yeah. Probably. I would say it was probably something like that. I saw it. And it upsets me, like... I tried to find, like, Aaron and I were thinking about a solution. We were like, let's give it the lighthouse. And then they wouldn't accept it. Neil comes walking up, who's a chef for 25 years, and What's he's like, chef? you know what? You actually cannot give cooked food to a homeless shelter, which is bullshit. Unless... Uh, they don't know the source. Exactly. I guess that's what I was going to... That's why I said unless. They don't know the source. Unfortunately, yeah. That's so much food. Yep. Act two. I don't even know whether we did Act one. Is that Bruce Willis? <laughs> oh my God! It's Ellen Page. Oh, <laughs> the that. We that broad. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Strictly forbids us from interfering. Okay, I do know this. That's <laughs> well, they use Ellen Page's face in everything, and that's why they. That's why uh, Bet Between Two Souls got a. Uh, no, it wasn't Between Two Souls. The Last of Us got sued for it, but Between Two Souls had the rights for it. Yeah. Yeah, man. Ellen Page. Uh, yeah, Ellen. Well, no. <laughs> it's Ellen Page, but they can't use Ellen Page anymore, so they're gonna use like Christina Aguilera or something like that. They said, and it's gonna be her as a 17-year-old battling all the zombies. Dude, she made her new debut. <laughs> I don't know, man. <laughs> It's like nobody would know who she is except for her. Yeah, she went, she went on to do that song that's like, If I was a rich girl... No, that's been funny. No, 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 no. If I had all the money in the world, I'd still sound fancy song. Red Man punches that fucking circus clown or something. She looks awesome. Guys, a yeah, very dramatic is scene is happening. <laughs> that is Tyrael, I know that. Tyrael the, the Muriel. What the hell is going on? Tyrael the Angel. Earth. Earth Angel? Earth Will you be mine? I fell. I don't even know if that's the right thing. It's like, will you be mine? It's more like that. You are already at full life. Okay, I get it. <laughs> Fly me to the moon. Ellen Page, take me to the moon. <laughs> no? Oh no, Ducker Kane. I do Shane know that guy's son? name. Ducker Kane is dead, folks. Is she gonna send him back in time to the Wolverine days? Boom! X Men reference. X Men to the past. You are already at full life. <laughs> you are not Decker Team. <laughs> you are already at full life. I just hit that button right at the last second, I guess, before the action. Oh my goodness. I wish she was my girlfriend. I wish she was my girlfriend. <laughs> Yeah, it's called I Wish She Was My Girlfriend by oh, yeah. Mitchell Jackson. Kilo, right? I have no idea what the <laughs> fuck you're talking about. <laughs> I wish I was a little bit taller. I wish I was a brawler. I wish I had a girl, girl that if I did, good, I would call her. <laughs> I guess that's a song about anything, you know? You just have to be confident in what you sing about. You guys should write a rap song called, called Act 2. Act 2. Yo, I went to Act 2. I never the thought I would get it through. Act one. <laughs> Come on, you guys gotta back, back me up. Don't even look at me. I'm a fucking. Okay, beat, beatbox. Like Someone beatbox. <laughs> yeah. Uh. <clears throat> I went through the act one. Never thought I'd get through act two. I got it through, through, through. Never gonna believe that I got it through. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, you're done. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, so no. We man. tried though. <laughs> that beatboxing was uh, out of the out of the century, man. Whatever. Uh, <laughs> my dry my dry throat acted up because my whiskey was <laughs> thirsty. You gotta learn how to gurgle with your throat while also doing the. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah, <laughs> you got it. You got it. The vibrations. The you got it. Because you know how. Uh, 
voice boxes work, they use vibrations, right? Yes. So you gotta like use your voice box to <laughs> vibrate your brain. I heard you came here from Tristram. My family has been there. Dudes. <laughs> my dudes, my dudes, my dudes, I came here from California, what's up? Vaping. Too much vaping in the world these days, guys. Spice Dude, I hate the fact that that's so popular, but I had one the other day, and they're fucking good. I they're hate, not good. I hate, well, okay, it was a chai, whatever they have at Starbucks that are worth. Chai, chai no, 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 <laughs> He's chai. Like right on it, venti. I know exactly what it is. I want to have a venti chai pumpkin spice something latte. And Marietta, whoever was working on Sunday, was like... You're gonna like this, and I was like, I don't like the fact that I'm gonna like this, and she was like, you're gonna like this, and I had it, and I liked it, and I don't regret it. I loved it. Love, Love is a hard word to say. I know. I've had one too. Yeah, man, they're good. But you don't admit they're good. They're one of those things that they're good that you don't admit that's good. It's like screwing fat chicks and riding mopeds. It's like screwing fat <laughs> chicks and riding mopeds. <laughs> they're fun until your friends see you. Oh no. See, I would care. You could go ride a moped and uh, or ride a uh, ride a fat motep, mo, <laughs> motep, motep, motep or whatever you're saying. I would never judge. Okay. I would never. I'd be like, dude, good work. Good work. You've earned it. On the way to Starbucks. Oh. That's where we crossed the line. Fuck Except yeah. I was just defending Starbucks. <laughs> I hate Starbucks. Why? Because yeah, it's a big business? No, because it, the coffee sucks. Well, you don't drink coffee. No one goes to Starbucks to drink coffee. What they do drink. They go there for? But espresso. The stones? <laughs> I love the way you said that. Oh, what the fuck did they do? It's the fucking coffee It's the thing. art. Okay, for example, no one goes to the fucking keg because the food tastes good. They go there because they they get a little dessert thing with a little rose colored. Uh, what do you call that? Ice cream uh, sample. No, you're wrong. What do you <laughs> put? Soft serve ice cream? Okay, another example. <laughs> Micros. No, Moxies. 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 You go to Moxies. No one goes to Moxies because of the food. They go to Moxies because there's that dry ice machine that blows up the whole restaurant when they put a little bit of a. Oh, whoosh, 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 the uh, whoosh, brownie whoosh, thing. Fog. It's ice cream, man. I used to go there as a kid. You put a little. As a kid? Yeah, I used to go to Moxie's as a kid. I used to work there when you were probably a kid. <laughs> Dude, you're like 15 years older than me, not only. Yeah, I know. Oh, I yeah, okay, that 17. makes sense. <laughs> <laughs> I washed your dishes. <laughs> and you're still doing it today. Oh, Fuck yeah. <laughs> I got nothing to say. You worked at Moxie's? <laughs> I worked at Moxie's. Did you make the dry ice things? No. Like you're, a way you to don't make, make dry, dry ice, ice you buy it. So you're telling me my childhood is a lie? <laughs> yeah, and maybe a, a portion of it. Did they have a dry ice machine, maybe? No, you, <laughs> no, you can't. Oh, no. How do you make dry ice? All right, ice? so every parent listening today, <laughs> how do you make, make dry sure ice? that your children serve at least three months of their life, cook for three months of their life, and wash dishes for three months of their life. Oh. That's actually not a bad call. It's not a terrible idea. But add raking leaves into that, or like shoveling, shoveling the driveway. That's no, you shovel snow, you, you rake leaves, you do lawnmowers, like when you're a kid, when you, like, to help your neighbors, your older Yeah, neighbors. you should always do that. I mean, your, your 80 year old neighbor, if like a seven year old came over and said, can I shovel your snow? Well, yeah, he's going to give yeah. you probably like 20 bucks and some candy. So you're saying that everything is well, about I money. I five bucks when no. I did <laughs> No, I, no so I do it for free, but... Not everyone's as kind as you are. No. Oh, I did it just to make money. Well, shoveling, shoveling snow is, is, is a very difficult concept to grasp because... Living in Saskatoon is a lot different than living, you know, yeah. Minnesota or wherever the fuck you live in when you shovel snow everywhere else. <laughs> and, like, Europe doesn't no get... No one's going to do four feet of snow for free. No, exactly, right? <laughs> exactly. Yeah, you know, exactly. like, it's back work, it's hard work, it is lifting, th like, I don't know, how much is a pound of snow? Like, well, a pound? A pound too much. One pound too much. Snowy, pound too much. Gentlemen. And I know I shouldn't call you that because it's false. Which is but, that? I am a gentleman. I, actually, I just held on to that. Sorry. Fucking tell me that, right? When I was grounded when I was younger, I got off grounding early 
because I helped out my neighbors that are like. But that's a question no one cares about. But the real question is, <laughs> why were you sure. grounded? Multiple reasons. Probably uh, egg in that guy's house. <laughs> you egged a guy's house, got grounded, so you had to. Probably now so. we're getting to the bottom of it. <laughs> you know what we should get to the bottom of? That whiskey barrel. That's not or... Yeah, actually, the beer actually tastes a lot had better. A barrel in here. That would be cool. Would, would just See, like I, suck I out of a straw. I knew he was coming over. I'm like, should I get a two six? I'm like, nah, he's probably got his own. Dude, I can hit you back with the beers that I bought in the nah, fridge. Maybe I'll try one of those later. A bow beer. Maybe we'll like some uh, a bow beer maybe we'll whiskers. Like some Eighty year old people's houses and then shovel their sidewalks to Dude, make up for it later. Dude, you yeah. have convinced me, and I will. I will. I will shovel them. It's fallout. Oh, we should make like a, a soft cushion for a potato gun, but shoot eggs out of it. With parachutes on it? Dude, that would hurt. <laughs> well, not at people, dipshits. Like, it helps it. I don't mean that it would hurt people. It would hurt oh. me because I love eggs. And and I don't like just, them going to waste. And then just sell them to, to kids <laughs> so, for Halloween because they want to egg houses, right? That actually would be a pretty good Dude, idea. Dude, you're talking about the black market, man. You're just selling, like, bad things to bad people to do bad things. <laughs> <laughs> that is true. But it probably could maybe get a little bit of a market. Oh, it would get a market for sure because people like to Halloween, do bad things. Though, right? People like us would buy them. <laughs> well, but, but I've never egged a house ever. We are you're generally good no, people. I okay, haven't. I have not egged a house, but I've egged a I swimming egged pool. So many. <laughs> <laughs> All right, it's your turn. The peanut gallery is a. I've never even toilet, toilet paper to hose yet either. Well, let's do it. Let's keep. Yeah, yeah, let's. Fuck it. Not Everyone's gonna be like paper, Halloween's nope. in a week. <laughs> it's okay. That's when you're supposed to start stocking up on eggs. You let them go overdue, and then you egg them. <laughs> Yeah, like you eat them out. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh, so they know? stink? I would yeah. want to eat them. Though, Holy maybe. shit, you're, well, you're, you're, you're psycho. I, I like it. Want to let go back. You know how funny it That's is that egg hostess with hard-boiled eggs? Because my mom knew that we were going to steal her eggs one year, <laughs> so, so she, she hard-boiled hard all of them. <laughs> so through a window? It, no, no, no. <laughs> everything blew it's up. The egg whites and everything shells blew up and just this grave overcooked fucking <laughs> yeah. egg yolk stuck to the side of the house. And I came home and I gave my mom shit. And I'm like, you hard boiled No, honestly. Fuck you, mom. I wanted to use I'm these like, eggs mom, for... Mom, you hard boiled all the eggs. She goes, how'd you know? Did you eat them? I'm like, no, I don't like hard-boiled eggs. You know that? She goes, what, how'd you find out they were hard-boiled? I'm like, well, I threw them at the neighbor's house and just I <laughs> just so straight up. <laughs> well, no, I told you the truth. Like, I came at her hot and heavy, hey, man. I was, yeah, I was, I was mad. That's not the way you're supposed to be coming towards you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was a weird way to put that. However, I do have a solution for you for eating hard-boiled eggs. You know, you want to know what trick? You use a, you use a spoon. <laughs> Cut it in half. You grab a little butter. <laughs> Scoop it in there. Dude, it is the most unreal flavor. Use a spoon to cut it in half. Yeah, actually. I'm not even kidding. I know, use so a spoon. A <laughs> yeah, and then you so use... So take the butt end of the spoon, yeah. top it through the bot. Yeah. No. Hit it through well, the top. No, not like that. Not from the top. <laughs> through the side. Yeah, <laughs> through the yeah. side. Through the side. Okay. You hit it through the side. Yeah, and I'm gonna wrap... No, I'm not gonna wrap. So okay. then you, <laughs> mean you use the end of the spoon. Yeah. yeah. Oh my God. Do you guys not know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. Like, the, the and, then, and then you take some butter. Okay. Pretend this is the end of a spoon. Yeah. Right. Yes. The end. Like, like the handle. Of no. This is the handle. Okay. I'm holding the handle. Okay. So you're actually, saying yeah, use hand. the actual. Yeah. Curve. You go like. Part. It goes through right really quick because eggshells are as weak as shit. And then you get a little butter. You stick it on your spoon. Scoop it out. And then you scoop out half. And then you go put it in your mouth. You put in some salt on it too. Salt and yeah. pepper. Yeah, dude. It is good. It's almost as good as Doug. Ghetto devil eggs. Ghetto devil dev 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 eggs. <laughs> well, there's no devil in there because there's no. Uh, as if you're a bad person, right? Wow. I mean, but you're not using cayenne pepper. Well, Whoa, that was awesome. Paprika. Or paprika. Sorry, that's what I was. Going Joel, for. you were wearing an original sixteen paprika. shirt. Paprika. Paprika. Where did you get an original sixteen yeah. shirt? Paprika. Anything paprika. fits you good. You're like in pap. shape. Paprika. Yeah, paprika. Like a pap smear. Not Take a your shirt smear. off. Paprika. Paprika. Oh, ouch. <laughs> <laughs> and I am out, party people. <laughs> I was like, no, I don't know. I just lost control. And just... Can you grab me a beer since you're up? Yeah. Joel. Grab us a beer, Joel. I'll have a beer.
I love having a cat. I love having a beer on a Saturday. Wait, what day is it? Friday. Guys, Friday's fine. It's almost 7 o'clock. But when you guys, like, actually load this, if you are gonna load this, it's probably <laughs> Saturday.